with Dylan Cousins at the NHL Scouting Combine. Dylan, first off, the obvious is I'm one of the few people you probably know at this event that's driven that Alaska Highway. I didn't foresee ever talking to someone from the Yukon at this event. Uh, tell me a little bit about your journey. Uh, give me the Coles notes, if you will. Yeah, it's, it's been a long journey and a tough journey. Just growing up there and playing hockey there, the, the competition wasn't the best. Uh, and I didn't ever get to play against other kids my age, you know, at the top level. Like, if we were in the Pee Wee uh, rep team, we'd play in the Bantam House League. So it definitely wasn't ideal. And then when you got to a certain age, you'd play against grown men. And I, I think when I was 12 years old, I, I broke my leg playing against grown men. So I knew that wasn't going to work and that if I wanted to, you know, chase my dreams of playing in the NHL, I'd have to move. And, and then I did when I was 14 years old. And that's a little bit earlier than a lot of kids have to. So yeah. I'm just curious, you know, is, is that part of what makes you a mentally tough player today? Because that could not have been an easy decision, even though you're chasing a dream. Yeah, for sure. I, it definitely helped me mature quick. Just leaving my family when I was 14 years old, I, it was a big adjustment and I had to, you know, mature really quickly. And I think it's definitely helped with my mental strength. I know you had to leave because you wanted to chase the NHL dream. But at the same time, I get the sense that you're very proud of where you're from and you know you're in a bit of uncharted territory. Brian Baltimore is an oiler. He, yeah. he made it for a couple games back in the day, yeah. but it means something to you. Oh, yeah, for sure. I wouldn't want to change my path at all. You know, so I could say that I wish I grew up in Vancouver and got to play against competition my whole life, but I, I wouldn't want that. I'm happy where I came from, and I'm happy with the path I've overcome and, and the things that I've overcome to get where I am today, and I wouldn't change a thing about it. Well, you might change one thing, and that's that first-round series. I, I know uh, it was a, a disappointing end to a really good season uh, for you personally and for the club in Lethbridge. Yeah, that was definitely disappointing. Uh, it shocked us. Like, we... We weren't ready to go out that early and we were surprised and it was very disappointing and heartbreaking. Have you talked to the Oilers? Are you potentially uh, you know, a player that you feel might be on their radar? Yeah, I, I met with them uh, multiple times, so it went well and you know, I hope I'm on their radar. That's Dylan Cousins from Buffalo.